Oh, wow. Today was a great day. First of all, let me tell you guys, I was in New York City today and wow. All I have to say is there was so much power, so much power in the air. This aluminum thing, this these plastic things. So I want to tell you guys why I'm making this video, number one. And I know that we're living in times right now where some people are struggling to either get away from a job or struggling to try to find a way to make extra money or just struggling in general because there aren't any jobs. And no matter how hard they try, they can't really position themselves where they need to be at, either in the business world, uh, maybe you have a business or hustle that's not doing well and you're just trying to figure things out. And I understand what that's like. I've been there before. So let me just say this. Uh, number one, uh, there are some financial hacks out there. And one of the financial hacks I talk about the most in my videos is bottles and cans. Now it's underestimated because these things are only worth five cents, but the key to accumulating these and making money is speed. I was in New York city today and I saw us, there was people with very large garbage bags filled with bottles and cans. And I wanted to celebrate like never before seeing this thing happen because it goes, it takes me back to when I was out there struggling homeless and I didn't have anything to my name, not a single dollar. And I was trying to make it out there. And I, I discovered this little hack, bottles and cans. And I graduated to other things. I started finding things in the streets that I could sell to make more money. And I, when I moved upstate uh, to upstate New York, where I live now, I discovered, you know, yard sales, estate sales, garage sales. These are actually really powerful as well. I think all over New York, uh, you could say that universally, there's always a hustle available for those who are interested and ambitious enough to make money. So if you're a moneymaker, uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel. I want to try to make more videos. I'm going to be doing that uh, in the month of October. I think I might start my 365 day video a day uh, journey uh, starting in October. I want to do one video every day for, for, for one year. I want to see where that takes my channel. I want to see where that takes me because I really want to talk about these things. I want to get people in the know. But right now, today's video is just basically talking about bottles and cans, what you need to succeed when you're out there collecting these. Now, here's the thing. If you're going to be out there all day long, trust you me, I'm talking about breaking your back, sweating. Uh, you know, if, even if you're the worst at it, you're going to make 50 bucks a day if you're out there all day and you at least try. If you at least try and you're active uh, for the entire time that you're out there, you're going to make a minimum of at least $50. When you're a little bit more seasoned and you get better and you understand a little better, you're you're looking at anywhere between $75 to $110. When you're really, really, really good, and I mean super good, you're looking at something close to around $200. Now, um, I could talk about some of the people who really did it huge, but there are so many different ways to, to do this. Let me, let me uh, find a way to get this. Okay. There are so many ways to do this, and I'm going to say this right now. If you're out there and you can't separate yourself from your video game, uh, your console, you love sitting on your couch and watching television, you're not gonna make it in this new economy. Unless for some reason you are already really wealthy, you have a business in your name and you're kind of like a silent partner or you have capital working for you that's invested, you're some sort of landlord or something else. That's the only way that being a video game or you use video game, you use gaming as another income. That's the only way. But if you're lazy, this new economy is not for you. Um, but work-life balance is very important. Uh, the nine to five is not cutting it for most people. Uh, nine, to five, nine to fives are not working for most people. Even if you do make a lot of money with a nine to five, the stress levels, it's very unhealthy to expose yourself to so much stress. So keep that in mind. If you're out there, you're working your behind off. Um, I want to get a thumbs up on this video from as many people as possible. Please don't watch this and not hit the thumbs up button because the only way for this video to reach other people is with your participation. You not hitting that thumbs up button is going to keep this video at very little views. So if you want the video to hit a few hundred to a few thousand views, you're gonna have to hit the like button. Right now, I'm suffering the reality of having subscribers who don't like to hit the thumbs up button. I have a bunch of subscribers who they just watch and they don't, I'd rather you press the thumbs up button and watch a little and get back to it later. Just hit that button. The minute you start watching, don't even think about it. Hit that that button. Get those watch time minutes in there too. So um, yeah, bottles and cans. So this will get you to where you, you need to go as far as funding your next hustle. Then you can start buying and selling. There's a lot of different tricks you can use. If you're out there and you're buying and selling, 
you can use some really good fundamental tricks to push your business to the next level. Trust me. Uh, with that being said, I'm extremely thankful for everyone watching this video. Make sure you tune in, subscribe to the channel, and keep it 100% hustle because side hustles rock. This is side hustle motivation. This time is for the money. Don't forget, I'm going to try that one video a day, every day for a year. Let's see if we can do it.